We have a song for you about Haman. You can't do it! <laughs> a little hard to see, Margaret. It's a little backlit. Here we go. Haman was somebody we can learn from. He wanted love, or he wanted fame, and he wanted fortune. Those things aren't bad. Go find them today. What's next? When he found fame, he thought he was better. So much better, better than you. When you find it, know that someone helped you. Sing his praises and worship him today. <laughs> That's our song for. Oh, I'm kind of. Yeah. Okay. In a night. All right. That's our song for Haman. And let's talk about it. I want to know, Margaret, what does Haman represent? Do you know? Haman represents pride. And what happens when you are walking in pride? So he found fame and fortune, but then he thought he was better. Right? He thought he was better than everybody, and then he decided that he was going to, you know. And when somebody did not treat him well, what happened? He tried to tear him down. And that's what people do, you know? Like, if they want to feel good, they'll tear people down. And so that's the problem with pride. What can we do? Do you know, Margaret? What can we do to stop being prideful? Do you know? No. You don't know? So we sang it in the song. Find your for your fame and fortune, but know that who helped you? Who helped you? Um, God. So that is one way that you can stop being prideful, is that you just know that everything, everything comes from who? It's like, wow, why, you know, why do I feel better than somebody when I just know that everything that I have comes from God? You won't feel better, right? You'll just be like, hey, for some reason, I got God's love here. All right, well, thank you so much for coming. I hope you have a wonderful day, wonderful Sunday. We are going to try to put out Pooh Reading today. So... Have fun and always have a boo day. <laughs>